Hello everyone. I'm Jessica Blackbird. Welcome to Hello my everyone. channel. Hello everyone. I'm Jessica. Like, share, Black and subscribe. Police have issued a warrant for Bleckley County Sheriff Christopher Cootie. That's south of Macon. Now, police say something happened last month at the Renaissance Atlanta Waverly Hotel. He's now charged with sexual battery. But in early 2022, former DeKalb County Sheriff Thomas Brown invited Judge Glenda Hatchett to a sheriff's convention, where he says he, the judge, and two others were approached by Bleckley County Sheriff Chris Cootie. And she asked him, uh, where was he from? Uh, he indicated what county he was from. Brown says Cootie told them his county was in the heart of Georgia. He wanted to emphasize the heart of Georgia, and he did that by placing his left hand on her left breast. Brown says he only saw Cootie touch the judge's chest once and intervened. I reached over, grabbed his hand, took it off of her, and basically said, what are you doing? Get your hands off of her. Brown says he led a shocked hatchet away. She's thinking, he is a sheriff. What do I do? Cootie is now officially charged with sexual battery. In a statement, Sheriff Cootie says he takes the charges very seriously and looks forward to personally expressing his regrets for any offense. Brown says he talked to Cootie the day after the alleged incident, angry at what happened. He is the chief law enforcement officer of his county. Um, the head of the law enforcement agency sets the tone for the culture of their agency. Law enforcement officers do not put up with law enforcement officers who do the wrong thing. Now it's possible for the Georgia Sheriff's Association to ask the governor to convene a panel to look into what happened. That investigation would run parallel to the criminal one and could lead to the sheriff being suspended. This is Judge Glenda Hatchett. She is the judge that he um, committed sexual battery on. Um, this is the sheriff who has now turned himself. Sheriff Christopher Cootie allegedly touched a woman's breast that we now know is uh, the judge uh, Hatchet at the hotel bar, according to his arrest warrant. The action was taken without her consent, the warrant states. Investigators said the alleged incident happened on January 18th at the Galleria Parkway Hotel and was reported to police the following day. At the time, the hotel was hosting the Georgia Sheriff's Association's three-day winter training conference, the association's online calendar shows. After interviewing multiple witnesses, people, police said they obtained the warrant January 28th for 57-year-old Cootie. He was not in custody until the Friday after because he was out of Georgia on a church-sponsored mission trip, according to Chief Deputy Daniel Cape with the Bleckley County Sheriff's Office. Shortly after 8 p.m., Cody was being booked into the Cobb Jail. He was released about an hour later after posting $1,000 bond. So, He's been the Bleckley County Sheriff since 2017. And according to this article, in 2009, Cootie's certification was put on probation for 24 months and he was required to attend anger management courses. It does not state why he was required to take those courses. So I don't know if this um, Sheriff Cootie had been drinking um, if he was drunk, if he was um, just feeling the liquor, what would have caused him to do this? And I mean, I'm assuming that it is true because he apologized and he turned himself in. He didn't say that it was a lie. He didn't say it didn't happen. And there were so many witnesses who corrob corroborated <laughs> that is a tongue twist over word, her story. So we'll just have to um, watch and see where this goes. To be honest, I don't think that he's going to go to jail because his record is clean. Um, but he does owe her a public apology and he does need more than a slap on the wrist because, I mean, how embarrassing to be in front of a room full of people and have some stranger grab you in that way. Oh, I would just be mortified. But we'll keep our eyes on this story. It's developing and um, 
Please like, share, and subscribe, and let me know what you think down in the comments. Let's have a discussion about this.